Okay, in this video, we're going to do accomplish two things. We're going to show how to change layers if you want to change layers and how to set up macros. Macros are very powerful on the SD9. They let you assign any, any feature or any set of keystrokes to any of these eight buttons. They're very useful for uh, setting up sends on, um, setting up um, VCA spills, save, maybe you want to play like a macro to save. I don't know, any, any, pretty much anything. You can go in and out of solo modes, whatever. But we need to change layers. And I've noticed when I turn on this console, usually there's a soft button that pops up in the lower left screen that lets you change layers. And it's gone at the moment. I've done something to the console and it's gone. And it, whether it's gone, shows up on your screen or doesn't show up on your screen, you may want to show it or hide it. It can get in the way when it's up and you're trying to mix. So let's, let's create a macro that both show and hide it. Um, so the macros are really powerful, as I said a moment ago. They're under setup. And there's a macro button. And I'm going to hide this layer button. And so here's the macros, if you don't mind zooming in. I'm going to make a new one. So I click the new button. And I'm going to name this macro uh, layout. So layouts, we'll call it that. OK. And uh, I need to go find, I'm going to go to layout. So layout right there. And there's a whole lot of options that I can make this macro out of. I want to um, I want to see the layer select buttons pop up. So I, I and then I'm going to assign those to macro button one. And there's a little picture there. And the last thing you do is capture, which is kind of like save. So I hit capture. So now if this is all done well, I'm so confident I'm going to close it. This should pop up, and it does. My little layer change buttons as I press the macro button. So now I can actually swap to a second layer, which I have nothing programmed to. Actually, it has the talk back, so on the third bank of the, uh, of the layer. But I can switch back to layer one. So this is how you switch layers. This is one way to switch layers. And this is another way it shows you how to hide those buttons and use macros all in one video. Congratulations, you're done with this video.